TR Rehab coming back at you with another video. Today we're gonna to be doing a video on my son's 025 Bird GT. We're having a problem with the windows not sealing, and that's a very common problem with these cars. They have the fiberglass inserts inside of the doors and they always give away. All the mounting brackets and supports on this door are totally shot. We're gonna show you a quick way we can get a fix on this. The first thing we're gonna do is let the windows down. And the reason why we're gonna do that is because when you let the windows down, it allows all the screws and the bolts to go back to the original position. And this allows us to go in and create a template so we can make a metal plate to reinforce the fiberglass wall that's given out in the door panel. Here, I'm just making sure that all my mounting holes match up to the template. So when I transfer it over to the metal, everything lines up when we put it back into the panel. We're gonna remove the speaker so we can access uh, the panel behind us when we have to put our screws in from the back side. There's a little clip on the back of the speaker connect. Just push it down and pull it out and you're able to release it. Here's the final makeup of my pattern. I did take out some of the access holes because I thought that wasn't necessary. Like I said, if we need to uh, get to the motor or anything like that in the future, we can always take the panel off. Here, I'm just lining up the plate to make sure that everything has a snug fit before I go ahead and start screwing everything down. As you can see, that top right screw, I'm leaving the bolt on it for right now because that's holding the motor in place. And if I let that go, it kind of lets the window go into its own direction and I need it to stay seated while I mount everything in. We're just making an oblong slash in there and we're gonna use a little flat surface so that this rests on it in its natural position. Now that we have it all in place, everything seems to be fitting well, we're gonna go ahead and start tightening down all of our screws and nuts. And I'm using quarter inch screws and nuts with uh, lock washers on it to make sure that this thing doesn't vibrate out of place once we have it installed. Sixteenth ratchet. Wash on there. Here we're just giving it a test run, sending the window up, sending it down. Uh, if you take a look at the plate, you'll see it's not flexing at all. It's very sturdy and looks like this is gonna be a good fix. Now, as you can see, we're matched up exactly where the window should line up at. Now we're gonna let the window up with the door closed to make sure that we get a good seal going all the way around from the pillars to the uh, T-tops. And it looks to me like we got a good seal. TR Rehab, thanks for watching.